welcome to my channel horror mama here and today i have for you zobie's extra large horror box this box was i believe 200 dollars, and it will include three signed items i believe it's a jersey and two maybe eight by tens or something to that effect um however i'm not i know Friday the 13th was one franchise, and I cannot remember the other two, but you already probably see it, which is right here. So it's going to be just another surprise to me. I could have looked it up, but I decided not to. Just put it up here and let you all see first. So, here is their extra large. Their extra large. It's kind of small, but that's okay if the print, I mean, the uh, autos are good and the jersey's good. It's worth it, right? So let's go. Let's go. I just got this. To, to, when did I get it? No. no, not by the time you see this video. I got it on May the 4th be with you. Oh my gosh, I saw that so many times. <gasps> did anybody else get driven crazy by that? Okay, it's funny for about a second. Then you start seeing a hundred posts about it. It's like, okay, I get it. Wow, nice jersey here. Okay, and I cannot see these. These prints are upside down. So, uh, who is this jersey signed by? Is it going to be good enough for me to want to keep? What? Is that King Hotter? Oh, I think it is. I do believe that's his signature. Is it? Check this out. Wow, that's a... Okay, you have the Crystal Lake Slashers. This is awesome, y'all. <laughs> Crystal Lake Slashers. And on the back, sure looks like Kane Hodder's signature to me because I have it right up there. That's his signature. Jersey signed by Kane Hodder. I love it. He is my favorite, Jason. He gave, he gave the energy and the stance and who Jason is today. He thats he gave it to him. I'm not poo-pooing any of the other Jasons. They're all great. I mean, right? But check it out. Nice. I love it. And the sleeves. Oh. Hmm. Okay. Do I want to wear this? Probably not because I'm not going to want to wash it. So I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do. Um, definitely a keeper. I just got to figure out how do I want to display it because I don't do, I'm just going to probably have to just, um, if you can get it framed. It depends on how much it is. But let's see who the next one is. Who is this? The Nun. Oh, what's her name again? What is her name again? Oh my gosh. Why can I not remember her name? Is it Bonnie? I don't... Wait, but that doesn't say Bonnie, does it? I do like this 8x10, though. Because if it's who I think it is, I don't have her autograph yet. Is it going to tell us who these are? It's not going to tell us? There's nothing in there to tell us? And this is... Wes Craven's The People Under the Stairs. Will R... Something... You know, I can look, I'm going to look this up um, and see who it is. I wonder if they meant to put... Oh, I'm sorry. Let me show you the picture. I guess that would be a nice idea. Will or... Oh, I'm not sure. I'll get it. I'll put it underneath. I do like the picture. Um, however, I just don't... Yeah. I mean, I know Kane Hodder's signature, and I would think... If this is the nun. What's her name? Bonnie something, right? So, the jersey, which is great. Two great 8 by 10 sign. And, by the way, in case you're wondering, this is not a cheap, flimsy jersey. This is nice and thick. The stitching is well done. It's nothing, nothing chintzy or cheesy about this at all. Everything, every patch, everything is stitched in. So it's, um, I don't know who makes these. I don't see it. They probably make them for, you know, things like this. However, 
I do not know. I know it's signed in Sharpie, but I still wouldn't want to wear it, get it dirty, and then have to wash it because it's got that little JSA on it, too. So, anyway. Anyway, yeah. Okay, I am happy with the box. I think it's a great box. Say what the franchises were, like I said. I just didn't remember it. But anyway, great box. Love it. You all take care. I'll be back real soon with more videos.